Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, New Growth Naturals. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, wherever you are in the world. Welcome to another live stream. So happy that you're here. <laughs> so today we're doing a corner updo on 4C natural hair, on short 4C natural hair. And we're freestyling as usual. So I'm just making a circle at the top of her head. Let me bring this in closer so you can see. Hi, Erica. Welcome to the live stream. Right. Just so you can see better. Let me fix this camera for you. Thanks to the person that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You're so awesome. <laughs> right. So I made a circle at the top. Yeah. I'm going to tuck this away. So what I'm going to be using to braid is a Shine and Jam Conditioning Gel. That's the consistency of it. This is what it looks like. This will help to control the frizz and to make the style last longer. That's why I'm using it. Alright. Alright, so let's braid away. I'm using this comb for parting. I like to use this comb because the teeth give you a really clean parting. But notice I never use this comb to detangle her hair. Her hair is freshly washed. I lightly blow it out. So now I'm just going to go and start. Conway. Hi, Janelle. Hi, Gary. Hi, Donna. Welcome to the live stream, everyone. I like clean parts. Hi Sidonia. Hi Cozy. Hi Patrice. How are you today? This will be a simple corner of you. Simple but elegant. This client in particular likes her here. Really simple but nice. Yeah. <laughs> She's laughing. You know what? No fancy dancing, no thing. So I have to keep it real simple. Hi, Cynthia. Yes, Sidonia. I can hardly check my email these days. I do apologize, but when I get a chance, I'll be responding to all. Or as much as possible. Work has been crazy. I'm not complaining. I'm really giving God thanks. Martha. I'm doing well. Hi Bree, how are you? And thanks to the 14 persons that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You guys are so awesome. I know y'all didn't give the live stream a thumbs up because you just entered the chat right away. You can exit the chat and then give a thumbs up and come back to the chat. Hi Carlin. How are you, my dear? All the way in Northern California. Make up yourself. I absolutely love doing porno of those. No matter how simple they are or sophisticated, I just love porno of those. You guys, corner, are you here, by the way? Or you just like to watch me cornering people here? <laughs> Hi, Haley. Hi, Candy. Hi, 
Hi Jacqueline. Hi Lala. Yes, Ailey. Not a big bun, just a little bun. Because she don't have much hair. <laughs> she doesn't have much hair. Wow, thanks to the 24 persons that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You know you're so awesome. <laughs> Hi, Takia. Hi, Candy. Once more. Hi, Candy. You can send me an email if your question is really personal and you don't want to type it in the chat. Send an email to newgrowthnaturals at gmail.com. And thanks to my new subscribers for so subscribing to the channel. Welcome to the New Growth Naturals family on this channel. I not only post videos to help you with healthy natural hair growth, I also do lots of natural hairstyles. Mostly carnals, by the way, and twists. <laughs> yeah. Hi, I do. Hi, Merlin. So, Merlin asks if I use oil before I start braiding. I washed her hair and moisturized and blow dried her hair. If you look on my hand, it is pretty tiny. There's a lot of oils in that moisturizer that I make. I use my DIY shea butter recipe. It has castor oil, extra virgin olive oil, and so many other oils in it. Plus, you know, African shea butter is oily. Butter, in general, tends to be oily. Hi, Sidonia. Newgrowthnaturals at gmail.com Oh, you have to go on YouTube. It's not on oh. Facebook. <laughs> She's trying to find a live stream on Facebook. By the way, guys, pray for my client. She 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 damaged her ankle. Did you break it or it just broke? It's, it's broken. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so she has to be using a crush now. And it's funny what she was doing when she got it broken. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you what she was doing to break her ankle. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Sedonia. <laughs> Let's turn it a little bit first. I can't hear it echoing it. Hi, Just Jenny. Welcome to the live stream, and thanks to the 34 persons that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You know, you're so awesome. So we're braiding away. Hi, Evelyn from Jamaica. Big up yourself, girl. Right, so somebody asked me early on if they said they noticed that I was using a gel to braid her hair, but did I put oils or anything like that on the hair? Let me tell you something. I never braid somebody hair that is dry. I don't comb dry hair. No. Because that's just going to make me in damage for the hair. That's going to cause breakage. And a whole lot of other issues. So, I did wash her hair. I did moisturize her hair. And I did blow dry her hair. And yes, her hair has oils in it. Because the shea butter recipe that I use have a lot of oils in it. All right. Oh, 
but we prefer to stretch hair before we braid it because it makes the style last longer, especially on a 4C texture here. And stretching don't always mean that you have to blow dry the hair. You can do the banding method and make sure that your hair is dry as in not wet. And then you can use, you could do African threading, several different means and ways to stretch your hair. But once the hair is stretched, the style will last longer. Hi, Jacint. Hi, Monique. Hi, Donna. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, I'm just checking out. Oh, that's cool. I, I am Ziri. Oh. Tomorrow. How long do you think it'll take me to finish the style? Mm -hmm. Hi, Angela. Mm -hmm. Good morning mm -hmm. to you. She, she's it's live 11 minutes. Ready when you're live stream. It's 11 minutes, almost 12 minutes into the live stream. How long do you think it's going right. to take me to complete All this right. style? Beverly. Okay, Haley say in the next 45 minutes. Okay, Haley. I see you. When when COVID stop rain supreme. <laughs> I'll visit your country, okay? Monique. Hi, Cynthia. Good morning to you. Hello, Martha. Colette. Good morning to you, ma'am. I'm so happy, guys. I miss you. Whenever I don't come live, like if a day pass and I'm not live, just believe I miss you all so much. Yeah, I don't even know why I miss you so much. Yeah, because you're always keeping my company and talking to me and asking me nice questions. <laughs> yeah. Y'all are just, just, just sweet, really sweet people. Oh, that's so nice. Maybe not 30 minute money, but soon I hope. Yes, Colette, I was so tired yesterday. Really, really tired. Okay, I'll come to United States after COVID. <laughs> And thanks to the 40 person that gave this live stream a thumbs up. You know you're so awesome. <laughs> Tell you what I'll do. I'll invent a braiding machine that braids perfectly. Thank you. Thank you, Angela. That's awesome, Justin. God is awesome. And I thank God for giving me this beautiful skill and talent so I can help people all over the world. Because your natural hair is beautiful. And that's how God created you. And he wants you to be like that. In all your natural hair glory. I'm not sure. She may not have gotten a notification. Yeah, I haven't seen Marilyn, Renee, Tia, and the others. Okay, just Jenny. Supposed to look really cute. I don't really 
do Valentine, Martha G. And because I don't really do it, not that I don't really. Yeah, I love people and I celebrate love every day, but I'm not the fan that it's just going to go out of my way to do stuff for Valentine's Day. So I was busy at work. Hi, Carlene. Carlene is your sister. Mm -hmm. Hi, Carlene. So today I'm braiding up your sisters here. <laughs> it's a small world. Hi, Shante. Good morning to you. That's awesome, Sedona. That is awesome. I just love African shea butter. I love mango butter too. And cocoa butter. I love so many natural butters. <laughs> For different purposes, of course. Yeah. When it comes to 4C here, I think... Not just forcey here, the porosity of most persons here. I think most people here like shea butter. Not all, but most of my clients do like it. Especially the combination of my concoction. Hi, I do. I'm in the Cayman Islands. Where are you living? Where in the world are you? I wish I could instruct you guys virtually to part here. All right, braid it like that now. <laughs> and it comes out the way I do it. <laughs> Hi, Georgia. Good morning to you. Yes, down the street. Mango butter can be used on here. And also cocoa butter. I make this edge growth product, but the base that I use is mango butter. Wow, 50 person gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. I just want you guys to know that you're so awesome. <laughs> I'm braiding away. joy god bless you too sedonia god is good all the time and all the time god is good god is good all the time through the darkest night his light will shine god is good god is good god is good if you're walking through the valley and there's shadows all around. Do not fear. He will guide you. He will keep you safe and from harm. <laughs> he has promised never to leave you nor forsake you. And his mercy is true. God is good. God is good all the time. Yeah, God is good. So I'm going to turn the camera so you can see what I'm doing up here. Then on this side, I'm not sure you guys can see. Hi, Zora. Welcome to the live. I can't stop singing praises to God. And I can't wear a mask because I don't have to wear a mask because I'm in the Cayman Islands. 
and we don't have COVID in our community. Yeah. So happy that you're here, Zora. Yeah. We don't need to wear masks here. It's not mandatory to wear masks here. What time is it in Nigeria, Zora? Okay. Okay. blessing God is good to us on this little island and the government here are doing a good job because what happened the borders are still closed but just in case families and friends or workers want to come you have to quarantine for two weeks so before you come you have to do a COVID test and then once you're here you do a COVID test then you go to quarantine if you're tested positive you have to stay there or you have to go back home of course until you get better and then once your two weeks expire you have to do another covid test before you're released into the community and that's how they're keeping cayman covid free okay i braid everything i don't braid tightly and i've been braiding my clients here for years so if i if braiding their edges or if their edges were braided tightly then they wouldn't have any to braid today <laughs> I'm not braiding, it looks very neat, but I'm not braiding tightly at all. Or else you see her making up her face and knitting her brows. Right, ma'am? <laughs> that, that can't fake. She's not feeling any pain at all. Not to worry. And these braids is gonna last her for almost three weeks. It's three weeks in how many people? Two to three weeks. Yeah. And since I'm not braiding with any extensions, her edges are fine. Amen, Mark. God is good. Indeed, God is good, Martha. Gee. Hi, Rose Hill. How are you today? Yes, Martha, God knows what is happening to you. And guess what? Our Heavenly Father has not left us or forsaken us. He loves us with an everlasting love. And he's touched with the feelings of our infirmities. So he's always there to comfort us in the time when we need it the most. And a lot of persons all over the world are suffering from anxiety issues. And a lot of stress. And tension mostly because of what is happening in the world not just because of covid yes covid has a lot to do with it but because of what comes with it you know other persons are suffering not just financially but mentally and other persons are wondering where is god in all of this he's right there and like i said he's touched with the feelings of our infirmities and he's waiting to help us you know to get through this crisis because we will overcome 
storms don't come to last forever. There must be a calm. At least, there must be a calm in your heart. <laughs> and that's the best place to have the calm. Because when you have a calm and a peaceful spirit, no matter what is happening on the outside, you'll be safe in your heart. And that's what is important. <laughs> Just a moment, guys. Hello, morning. I'm back guys. Sorry to keep you waiting. Hi Linda, good morning. Thank you, Carlene. And thanks to the 63 persons that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You guys are so awesome. <laughs> Hi, Tehor Co-op. Thank you, Just Jenny. Mm I'm braiding the opposite side, but I know you guys can see it in the mirror. <laughs> Thank you, Charlotte. I will try, Haley. Hi, Alicia. Have a blessed day to you, Erla. something so it's 29 minutes in the live stream so far we're doing a simple updo braided porno style and like I said I know it looks really neat and I took in all her edges but she's not feeling a thing there's no tension whatsoever on her head and she will tell you the truth <laughs> She's not, not feeling. Not on my scalp. <laughs> yeah, she's not feeling no pain on her scalp. Where are you living, Haley? Where in the world are you? Hi, 
Hi, Jackie. The clients prefer to have their the ends of their hair twist as opposed to braid it out. Hi, Angine. Thanks to the 70 person that gave this my stream a thumbs up so far. You guys know you're so awesome. <laughs> so happy that all of you are on here today with me. That depends on what kind of oils you're here like. I like to recommend castor oil, olive oil. Coconut oil, jojoba oil, argan oil, pumpkin seed oil. So many different oils, but that depends on your hair porosity and what your scalp and hair likes. Some persons don't like coconut oil because it makes your hair hard. That's dependent on your porosity. Some persons don't like castor oil because it's too thick. And they don't want their hair to be any thicker. So, some other oils, like argan oil and jojoba oil, is too light for some persons. It depends on what your hair like and what you like for your hair. You can mix them. Pardon me? Could you mix them? Yeah, you can mix oils. You can mix like a penetrating oil with a seeding oil. Yeah, my hair loves av avocado oil too. Go ahead with your question, Aretha. Hi, really, Mindy. Yeah, I like grapeseed oil too. But my hair loves black Jamaican castor oil, avocado oil, almond oil. Yeah. I mostly and pumpkin seed oil. My hair loves those. For some strange reason, I don't know why. <laughs> my hair hates coconut oil, but my scalp loves it. So whenever I use coconut oil, it's mostly on my scalp. If I use coconut oil on my hair, it's usually in a mixture to do like a hot oil treatment or a pre poo before I wash my hair. I never leave it on my hair really. Some puff function that I'm gonna wash that I'm gonna wash out later on. That's why I normally use coconut oil for my hair. That's awesome, yeah. Yeah, but try not to be a product junkie, guys. Whatever products that you find that works really nice for your hair, just stick to them. Unless you need better. Like, it's not doing something that you want it to do and you're trying to get it to do it. But otherwise, just stick to products that you're here like. Don't be trying new stuff all the time. Don't be a product junkie, guys. Just find products that work for your hair. It's hard to find most of the time. But once you find products that work for your hair, just stick to those set of products. Once it's a leave-in conditioner, you can try it. Once the Giovanni conditioner that you bought is a leave-in, something that you can leave on your hair, you can try it with the mixture. Or any other conditioner that you hear likes. All right. Good afternoon, Eve. Yeah, be careful, really, Mindy. Don't be a product junkie. Because one product can help you here and another totally damage it. So you want to be careful. 
not to be all over the place with where when it comes on to product. So we're gonna do the back now. That's awesome, just Jenny, because products are really expensive, especially good natural hair products. Hi, Kate. Hey, Ben. And thanks to the 77 persons that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You guys are so awesome. So if you're in my chat, if you haven't yet gave the live stream a thumbs up, exit the chat, thumbs up the video and come back to the chat. <laughs> Yeah. Hi, Sil. I miss you so much. Where have you been, girl? Thank you, Kaden. Just a moment, guys. My sister is calling me. <laughs> live as well. Ah, such a cute baby. So my sister has a baby. I'm going to show you guys the baby. Uh oh. God is so good. It fell with the cover on it. With my little niece. Ah, such a cutie. That's my sister's baby. So she's on video call. Yeah. Hi baby, can I call you back when I'm through? All right, bye. Yeah, such a cutie. Yeah, she's a sweetheart. I've not met her because of COVID because my sister lives in Trinidad. So I have not met the baby as yet. Can you believe? And she's getting so big. That's my first niece. No, my second niece actually.
<laughs> Thank you, Sedona. It doesn't make me want to have another one, though. <laughs> they're cute when they're that small. I think I'll adopt more children, but I don't want to go through that agony at all to bear one another one of my own, not at all. But I'll, I'll foster care a child or several children, but mm -mm, not going back through that. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Aretha, miss you already. Safe journey to work. And remember, Jesus loves you. So today, try to be very good. Hi, Stacy. And thanks to the 83 person that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You guys are so awesome. No, still, it's not weird. Yeah, thank you, Martha. All babies are cute. <laughs> I don't know. They just have this baby cute thing going on for them. I like to see them, but I don't want another one. That's awesome. Thank you. Or I should say you're welcome. <laughs> oh, and thanks to those that took the opportunity to donate and support this channel by PayPaling me. You guys are so awesome. And thanks for your support. And to those that want to support, because I don't have super chat, you can PayPal me at newgrowthnaturals at gmail.com. Yes, Jennifer, same with me. Thank you, Ethelia. I hope I pronounce your name properly. I was wondering where you were, but I figured that you probably did not get the notification. How are you today? How are you today? in the Cayman Islands that's where I'm at where are you located
Esther. That's awesome, princess. Hi, parts. Hi, party. Or should I say Arnita? <laughs> I be in focus. Welcome to the live stream. So happy that you're here. So it's 47 minutes in the live stream. And there's 90% that gave this live stream a thumbs up so far. You guys are so awesome. <laughs> And I'm braiding away. Thank you, Shuku. That's okay, Linda. God has blessed me to bless others. I don't mind sharing. Yes, Marilyn, pray for my strength. Okay, Ailey. <laughs> you guys are watching the time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm laughing because I never remember anything about that. <laughs> I never remember anything about you guys watching the time. But we're going at a good pace, though. Work of heart, however simple they are, takes time. That's awesome, Jennifer. What do you mean by if I don't get trolls, Jennifer? Hi, Milka. I'm in the Cayman Islands. Hi, Yvonne from Manzan. I can't even pronounce that country. Welcome to the live, ma'am. <laughs> yeah. That name. <laughs> Some places in the world I never thought existed. Welcome, my sister. Welcome to the live stream. We, 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 we may get a few trolls. I don't know. Ask Marilyn. She's more in the chat than myself. But they don't tend to stay. Because I realize we're nice people. <laughs> They don't like to stay around us. 
<laughs> Thank you, Martha. Thank you. Yeah, sorry for your loss, Jenny. Wow, 100 persons gave this live stream a thumbs up. How oh, awesome can you guys be? You guys are so awesome. <laughs> so, yeah. That's one thing I like about the New Growth Naturals family. You guys are so helpful and kind to one another. And I'd like for it to remain that way. We don't really get trolls, but when we do, they realize it's not safe for them. It's not a safe environment for them. Because we're going to outdo them with our niceness. So they generally just leave or convert. Which we like it when they convert. Because trolls need, need somebody to. They need people to talk to. They need people to care for them just the same. Hi, V. V put. Thank you. <laughs> yes, just Jenny, that is true. <laughs> that's, I guess that's a reaction that they don't expect. That's what somebody told me. They say the way you react to people sometimes can determine how they, you know, continue. And sometimes how we react to them, I guess they weren't expecting it. They were expecting us to be rude or, you know, angry or, you know. So they just don't know what to what to say anymore. Yeah. So it's fifty four minutes in the live stream and we're going. Wow, I have to pray for you, just Jenny. My condolences to your family. Sometimes I get the shea butter from Jamaica at Earth Sullivan. Sometimes I get it off Amazon. bring you closer so you can see what I'm doing let me fix this for you yeah I think you guys can see better from right here And the clock is ticking and we're going. Hi Octave.
That is truth. Everybody needs some kindness. And sometimes people are just having a bad life and a bad day. And they just react that way to everybody. Nothing wrong in being kind to them. Love conquers all. That's my belief. Love breaks every barrier. I'm in the Cayman Islands, B. 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 Put. Yeah, like I like the black soap from Earth Elements. I used to use it just on my face, though. I never use it on my hair. Always using it on my face. Especially at night, when I wake in the morning, my face will be so smooth and nice and clean. That was in, that was there at Earth's Element. I'm in the Cayman Islands. Yes, I do online consultations. Send me an email at newgrowthnaturals at gmail.com. Thanks to the 107 person that gave this live stream a thumbs up. You guys are so awesome. Mm -hmm. Oh, African black soap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a natural soap that. I always get it at Earth Element in Jamaica. I'm not sure where. Oh, yes, CEA has it. I think the Shea Moisture brand they have. Thank you, Andrea. By the way, have you guys subscribed to Andrea Peter's channel? She does awesome vegan meals. You guys should definitely check her out. She just started her channel. She's not perfect on the videos, but guess what? The meals are so awesome and healthy and tasty and look so delicious. By the way, Andre, you owe me a patty for that advertisement here. <laughs> I want patty. <laughs> it's Andre and Peters. Type the name of your channel in the chat, please, Andreen. Yeah, God is love. So this section that I parted earlier, the circling this section, I'm just going to twist it out. So in order to do our hair in this updo style, I didn't have to part the circle. But I parted the circle so when I'm through with the style, I'll have more twists to style. Yes, there's a consultation fee. And that depends on the length of time. You send me an email and I'll disclose that to you. Really? Ailey, that's nice. Yeah, so you guys go over and subscribe to Angie's Twitter channel. <laughs> Andrew and Mama Patty. <laughs> I 
I want my vegan patty. <laughs> <laughs> so you guys go over and subscribe to Andrea Pitcher's channel for some vegan dishes. Guys, my twin. <laughs> If I'm going to come to Michigan to do your hair, it's going to cost you more for the hairstyles. Or is it that you want to fly to Cayman to get your hair done? I'm answering Marilyn um, Boykins. Hi, Jill. No, Jill. <laughs> I'm so happy. Better late than never. I'm happy to see you. Right, so let me bring this a little higher so you guys can see what I'm gonna do to the top. Turn her like so. So we finish twisting the middle section. So our hair is fully completed. So let's top these under. I shall see. Yes, guys, Cayman Island is pretty expensive. One of the most expensive places to live in the world. Pretty expensive. Everything is expensive on this island. When I say everything, I mean everything. Really small and beautiful island. Very beautiful island. Okay, Beverly, I'll think about it. But I strongly believe that I may be in Trinidad before I go to Jamaica. <laughs> that may be the first place I go to. Or Canada. More so Trinidad. Just stuck in our ends under. Yeah, but they we don't have so much iguanas as before though here. They killed them out. Because they were destroying the vegetation. We do have beautiful blue, blue iguanas as the same. Okay, Shanti. Hi, Denise. Good afternoon. Our lives and all goes well for next year and the covid pandemic is not raging as oh it is now yeah you guys may see me in your country 
<laughs> yeah, it's not like that anymore, Haley. They got rid of most of the iguanas that were here. done. I think all of the ends are safely tucked away. So I'm going to show you what her style is looking like now that it is completed. Yes, Ailey. They, they got rid of most of them. This is what it looks like. Yeah, the style is completed. Thank you guys for coming to keep my company. It has been one hour and eight minutes in the live stream. You guys have been awesome. Remember, be good today because Jesus loves you. Bye. It's going to last her for three weeks. Send me an email, newgrownaturals at gmail.com. Bye, guys.